So let's say you don't have a massive set of 100 different dumbbell options, but you still wanna get a great strength workout in. Here's how to achieve progressive overload with a limited amount of weights. First way you can do this is control your tempo. So for instance, on a shoulder press, I can go all the way up and all the way back down at a moderate pace, or I can explode out of the bottom and control the eccentric portion of the lift to make sure I get more power generated on the way up and more control on the way down. Your second option would be to add a pause or a half rep in your shoulder press. So for instance, we take it all the way up, down pause and push back up or add a half pulse in between each full range of motion rep. The last tip is gonna to be to make sure your transition times are efficient. So in between when you're pressing, lowering and right here, when you're going up, a lot of people tend to just pause here and breathe, okay? Let's try and make sure you're still moving, you get down and start pressing back up when you're almost to the bottom to get more time under tension. Let me know how you're making progressive overload work for yourself as well.